All right, mind my hair, but hello everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If you are new here, please hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell. It really helps me out and you never want to miss a video of mine. All right, so, so basically I have three mice and I have, well, I have two hamsters, but I have a hamster. Um, and so my hamster, Elliot, my older hamster that I actually just made a video on having him for a year now, um, he is in a 40 gallon breeder. He's never really had problems with his cage really ever. Right when I f first got him, actually, I was like, oh my God, wait, I feel like he's a little scared, but it was just that he wasn't used to his cage yet. And I was actually going to downgrade him, um, which is such a bad thing. It would probably still be over the minimum. I was just like kind of worried about him and everything like that. But my three mice, they are very active animals. My hamster, Elliot, um, he's very active as well. My hamster, Elliot, is a very active hamster as well, or an ac active animal. Um, but I personally don't like, you know, there's no, like, urge to get him an upgrade. Um, he's pretty much fine in his cage that he is right now. But my mice are definitely, like, on a little active spree they I feel like they just need a bigger cage I personally just think that they do and so what my plan is today is to get a 75 gallon breeder no 75 gallon tank because they are half off at the moment at Petco since they do this deal that's like one dollar off or whatever or one dollar um per tank thing like so like if it was a 20 gallon tank it would be twenty dollars twenty dollars so with the bigger tanks i think it stops at 40 gallon breeders um they could become half off and so uh a 75 gallon tank is usually two hundred dollars so my plan is today is to switch elliot um we're gonna switch elliot into a 75 gallon tank and then we're going to switch the mice into my 40 gallon breeder. So that is the plan today. Um, I do. We're gonna go to Petco, and we're going to hopefully pick up the 20 or the 75 gallon tank. I am still trying to figure out if I want to just get a 40 gallon breeder for the mice. But the thing is, is that Elliot would be upgrading too. So it would be better. And then my smallest tank that I would have would be a 40 gallon breeder, which is still quite big. Um, the mice are in a 30 gallon. Um, so it's like, I think 400 and like 50, I think. Like it's just under the minimum for a hamster, but it is suitable for mice. But they've been wanting a bigger cage for a while now and then also that would let me have more mice as well like I would feel comfortable getting more mice and like you know having more mice I would feel more comfortable with it um instead of putting them in their um their 30 gallon breeder or 30 gallon tank I don't know if it's a 30 gallon breeder or whatever but um I mean I would put more mice in there but I feel like it would be um better to upgrade them before I get more mice so that's my plan. Basically what's happening is I'm getting a 75 gallon today. And so with that, Elliot will be getting my 75 gallon. So I will tell you it in a short little way. I'm getting a 75 gallon tank today and I am recording it. Um, Elliot will be getting my 75 gallon tank and then the mice, my three mice, basil, sage, and cotton will be getting the 40 gallon breeder. That's the plan. I am so excited. Oh my god, I hope this happens. I'm very excited. I will hopefully vlog it. I don't know if I will or won't, um, but hopefully I will be able to get some vlog footage of getting the 75 gallon tank. We're All right, so we are heading out right now. I am so excited. Um, we are not going to be able to set it up today or like whatever because um, we don't have a stand for it. So we're not, we're gonna have to wait. For the stand for me to be able to like put Elliot and then put the mice in the 40 gallon. So breeder. yeah, that's the plan right now. We're going to go and head out and we're going to get it. I don't think I'm going to be able to record it maybe in the car, but other than that, I don't think it will be able because my phone is broken. All right. Yeah. I'll update you guys, I guess. Okay. So we are finally back home. 
Um, I feel like it took, like, ages. I think it literally took, like, two hours. Um, we also went somewhere else. But, <laughs> here it is. So, I did, I did get the 75-gallon. Like I was saying, how I kind of didn't know if I wanted to get, um, the 75 gallon or if I wanted to get the 40 gallon I got the 75 gallon um it's heavy like very much so so like I said um we don't have a stand for it at the moment yet so I don't really know when it will actually be in use I, um holy crap is it a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be I did not expect it to be like when is when it was in the pet store I was just kind of like oh, okay like it's kind of big but then in my house or in my room holy crap is it huge all of a sudden like it's like really like um tall like already it I actually don't know how um how tall it actually is wait no I think it's 21 yeah it's 21 like, that's how tall it is, which is actually pretty tall because my other cages are 17 tall, and then that one's 14. The Ikea D-Lop is 14. Okay, guys, I'm going to sit in it to show you how big it is. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, my God. I swear, oh, my God. Like, there could easily fit two people in here, and it's literally the height of when I'm sitting down. Like, that's insanely insane. Oh, I can't get up. Okay. That's insane. In because I am beyond. This is the fun part of, like, getting a tank. You get to rip off it and saying it's yours. Officially, mine. Ah, that thing is hard. That one was a lot easier to take off. These are the best stickers because they're like super easy to peel off. And also, if you do have a dirty cage, um, like it has like fingerprints or whatever on it, you can easily just take off. The fingerprints with this little tip you can do that with this but yeah I cannot believe how big this is um I think it's oh my god I don't even know I think it's like 800 square inches I think it's somewhere around 800 I'll pop it up on the screen of how big the the cage is I still don't know if I'm going to um cut this off because because in my my mice's cage um they had one of these they had like this like part of it the like weird thing and it got in my way way too often and then when i got like the lid that has the lifting thing it was like in the way so i cut it off so i don't know if i am going to cut this piece off yet or if i am ever going to um but yeah, it's Look literally. Look at how absolutely gorgeous it is. Like, here's my hand compared to the whole thing. Like, my hand is huge. Or my, the tank is huge compared to my hand. It doesn't look as big on camera, but like, I don't know. Um, I really hope Elliot likes it. It's going to be a drastic change because I think his right now is 600. I think like 600 and... Or no, yeah, 650, I think, maybe. And then this is like 800 square inches, something around there. I'm going to measure. I'm going to pop up on the screen how big it is. I um, hope you guys but... enjoyed this video. This is such a special video for me. Like, it's literally so special. And this is something that I will always look back on. Like, this video, I will always look back on it since... This is a special day, and I bought it with all my... I bought it with my money, by the way, just to let you know. Um... I'm so excited to switch the mice cage into this and then into his cage and then the mice are going to get, or, and then Elliot will get this. 
so crazy. I wish, I really, really wish that I was able to um, do it right now, but I don't have enough bedding for Elliot to do it, so. And I don't have anywhere else to be put it. It would be right here in the middle of my room. So, yeah. Um, I'll, like, just in another video, I will, like, show you guys um, the setup of where it is and everything like that. I'll probably do, like, a tour on it or whatever. Milo's crying, so, yeah. Um, but I'll probably do a tour. And then if you do just want to see it, like, right away um, when I do actually get the stand or whatever, um, on my Instagram, I will be definitely posting that. So, Avery underscore underscore the hamster. It's always down in the link below. So, if you guys want, like, quick updates instead of waiting for a, a video or, or, like, a vlog, then go ahead on my Instagram. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.